Hi, I'm Tom Hutchinson from Hutchinson Plumbing, Heating, Cooling. I'm here today to talk to you about replacing the gas valve on your gas-fired furnace. When you're working on a gas appliance, it's always important to think of safety first and to make sure that the power is off to the unit and the gas valve, uh, gas to the appliance is also turned off. However, when you're look, work, looking to service the gas valve, you're going to leave the power on, you're going to leave the thermostat in the heat mode and calling for a temperature satisfactory to heat your home. The thermostat is going to send power to the control board. The control board is going to send power to the gas valve. At that point you want to check your voltage at the gas valve with the volt meter. If you have 24 volt power to the gas valve, the gas valve needs replacement. If you do not have 24 volt, then there's another problem outside the gas valve with your gas furnace. At that point, you want to call a professionally trained service technician to uh, service and repair your furnace. I'm Tom Hutchinson from Hutchinson Plumbing, Heating and Cooling. Thanks for watching. <laughs>